That was lightning. And thunder. You might know that when lightning strikes, the thunder is almost always delayed by some time. The flash appears first, and then the thunder follows. This is because the speed of light is much, much faster than the speed of sound. While the light from the lightning flash reaches you almost instantly, the sound from thunder actually takes a measurable amount of time to reach you from the lightning flash. This delay is approximately 3 seconds for every kilometer, or 5 seconds for every mile. So, how does this apply to Terraria? Well, the observer among you might notice that thunder in Terraria does have a delay to it relative to the lightning strike. It's a short delay, but it is there, and it is measurable. This means we can actually calculate how far away the related lightning strike should be from the player, even if we can't see it. For example, this thunderclap takes 1.42 seconds to appear after the lightning strike, meaning the strike took place around half a kilometer away. However, that's just one instance. Overall, the delay between thunder and lightning is random, so if you want to find out the total range of lightning distances, you'll need to look within the code. If you look in the method new lightning, you'll notice that the thunder delay time ranges between 1 and 120 ticks, or 0.016 and 2 seconds. When this timer hits 0, it'll play one of 7 random thunder noises, which is what you hear. And on top of that, some of these noises themselves are also delayed. For example, while thunder underscore 5 starts immediately, with no delay, Thunder Underscore 2 has a full 3 fourth second delay before it begins. This adds a full 0.75 seconds to the longest possible delay, meaning the actual Lightning Thunder delay in Terraria actually ranges between 0.016 and 2.75 seconds. The average Thunder delay is around 0.85 seconds. So now that we know that, how does it translate to distance? Well, let's start with the longest. 2.75 seconds at the speed of sound is about 935 meters, just shy of a kilometer. That's actually relatively close, and it's just about the distance from spawn to the dungeon on a small world. On the other hand, the shortest one is actually comically short. A 0.016 second delay, or 1 tick, corresponds to a distance of about 5 meters. Yeah. Rendered on the screen would be roughly here. Quite close, but a terrarian will probably be fine. Unfortunately, lightning isn't rendered in terraria, so you never get to see it, but it's funny to think about. So that's it for this short video. It's interesting to dissect such a benign and obscure mechanic sometimes. Hell, I even forgot this whole lightning thing existed for months because I left the config toggle off after this video. Still, I think these little details in Terraria 1.4 is what makes it feel so much more alive than 1.3 ever did.